The new iPad Pro with M5 finally delivers on everything this lineup's been promising for years. With iPadOS 26, it now feels like real pro hardware and not just an overpowered giant iPhone. The M5 chip brings a sizable leap in performance, about 14% faster CPU and 30-35% faster GPU or graphics compared to M4, plus a base 12 gigs of memory now, up from 8 gigabytes last year. The performance gains are of course even crazier compared to older M1, M2, and A12X and Z models. That means heavier tasks, complex projects, and on-device AI workflows now run faster and more consistently, with less slowdown under load. Storage speeds are also up to two times faster, so large projects can open more quickly, and in general, files write and read even more instantaneously, which makes the overall experience feel snappier. This faster storage can also be used as memory swapper virtual RAM, so again, more challenging tasks and more intense multitasking is gonna feel more smooth and less interrupted by buffering and reloads. We also finally get fast charging, which allows you to charge iPad Pro from zero to 50 in a about a half hour with a 60 watt adapter. This is huge if you're constantly pushing your iPad Pro with really demanding power hungry tasks and need to juice up a bit more. Meanwhile, the new Apple made C1X modem and N1 chip bring faster 5G, faster Wi-Fi 7 speeds, and Bluetooth 6, so everything from file transfers to cloud syncing feels quicker. And with the M5 chip's new display engine, working on a second screen feels even more buttery smooth and closer than ever to the Mac experience, thanks to improvements to overall responsiveness and most particularly support for 120Hz capable monitors, which matches the pro motion you get with the iPad iPad's built-in display. And again, paired with iPadOS 26's new features like the windowing, multitasking, menu bar, file management enhancements, background task support, improved Mac-like external drive workflow support, and more, the iPad Pro with M5 and the performance boosts it brings can finally be properly utilized and make it truly feel like the workstation Apple always wanted it to be.